an AL Central battle between the Twins and Royals. Former Royals Cookie Rojas and Amos Otis would throw out the first pitch, while former manager Whitey Herzog would exchange the lineup cards for the Royals. That made Royals fans happy indeed, but let's see if Salvador Perez could make them just as happy. Here he is at the plate in the first. Hit well to right field. Kepler to the track. Gone! That's the second time. In 10 days that Salvador Perez has hit a first inning home run against Lance Lynn. Line to left field, base hit in front of Rosario. That'll get one run home. And the Royals lead 3-1, and Lucas Duda has driven in four in this series. One on, one out, 3-1 to one Royals, inning number eight. And the ground ball into right center field for a hit. So it's 3-2. Minnesota gets its first run since the first inning. And Witt has more experience against Hildenberger than any other Royal. And it's grounded into left field. Merrifield gives the Royals a 4-2 lead. Whitley gets his one base hit when, it, when you need him. And they would go on to win this one by a score of 4-2. to two. In his first game back from the disabled list, Jacob Junis goes four innings, allowing one run on four hits while striking out six. He ends up with a no decision. Lance Lynn gets the loss. He allows three runs through five innings while walking six. And a nice day at the plate for Joe Maurer. He goes three for four with a double and a run scored.